welcome back everybody it's hack the gaming channel my name is hack and today i'm doing the third episode on how to start your own youtube channel we're going to talk about the software i use for editing software i use for uh, graphic design and where to get the software and everything this is my channel of course you guys recognize it by now uh and then let's get started so i want to talk about uh to you guys about the applications that i use i tried multiple multiple editing softwares i tried sony vegas uh, I tried the 2009 version because it's only 75 bucks, but it was terrible. It kept crashing. Rendering would take forever. I definitely don't recommend the old Sony Vegas. And the new one cost around $400, and I didn't have the money to pay for that. So I wanted to find something good. But unfortunately, there's nothing great for the pri low, uh, inexpensive price. And uh, all the professional ones are like a couple thousand dollars, and I couldn't afford that either. So I found a great solution. Right now, I'm using Adobe Premiere for uh, my editing software i use adobe after effects for my graphic design software uh, the intro and uh, outro you guys send and also the corner logo and then i also use photoshop for anything else like pictures and stuff like thumbnails and stuff like that so all of this if you want the uh, adobe premiere i think by itself it's 700 dollars and of course i can afford that uh and if you want everything you see here it's actually uh, i think two thousand or four thousand dollars which is crazy expensive but thank god for me adobe has this great program uh, if you go to their Adobe and sign sign up for their uh, uh, software pack, uh, what you have to do is it's pay as you go. If you're if you're not a student, it's thirty dollars a month, and it's not like you're paying thirty bucks a month till you hit four thousand. No, it's thirty dollars a month. If you stop being, paying that thirty dollars a month, uh, you can't use the software anymore. If you're a student though, it's only twenty bucks a month. It's very affordable, and for that twenty bucks a month you get everything here guys everything audio editing software uh, video editing software graphic design software web design software anything you can possibly ever need you can get installed everything here but um, uh, all i need right now is photoshop which i need to update adobe after effects and also adobe premiere pro which i definitely love i tried a bunch of other ones and i hated them i ended up returning it so if you can afford 20 bucks a month guys i definitely recommend you go with the programs i showed you so let's start with adobe premiere uh, Adobe Premiere is a really good quality software. It doesn't crash that much. I had, I think, one crash today or two crashes today, but I think it's because I'm using the GoPro uh, footage, which is kind of uh, slowing down everything. So I don't recommend you guys do that. Uh, but it's a really good program, for, but it takes a lot of work, guys. So what you see right here, right? This right here is five minutes. This is the funny montage video I edited on, I uploaded on Tuesday. But you can tell how much work it took me to do and I actually had to erase some of the stuff to use it in a different project but you can tell how much work this takes let me bring in the program monitor usually this program monitor you see right here that I'm dragging in here is on my other monitor so I can uh, use the, the space for other stuff so if you have a second monitor just drag this and put it in another monitor so you can have a clear view of the program it's a big nice big screen but let me show you exactly how much work it takes oh okay uh, this is the time counter I had to create myself. Um, this is the freeze um, freeze um, title right here. Uh, I had to adjust all the videos so it matches with the audio. That's what the numbers are. I was having a lot of problems with that. And sometimes you'll have issues like that. This is the audio edit right here. This is the chat edit right here. Uh, this is the sound effects right here. And that's the video. So it takes a lot of work. It takes me about three or four i play about four or five hours a day and i have to record all of that and then when i record all of that well i have to watch the whole four or five hours again again to find the funny stuff guys so one tip i'm going to give you guys as you edit make sure you label everything clearly it's going to save you a lot of time to find everything but i usually end up watching everything for two hours marking it labeling it and after i play so let's say i play four hours yeah i pretty much have to watch about three hours of it again and then I have to edit, which takes a couple hours. Rendering takes about half an hour. Uploading takes an hour, 45 minutes to an hour. So you can take, see, it takes a long time. And then you have to do thumbnails, descriptions, tags. So guys, if you're going to do this, I definitely recommend you guys go for it. But I want to tell you the truth. It's not easy. It's time consuming and you have to have a passion for it. It's not like if uh, I think the people, I think my friends, you guys like me so much because I've tried to put out good quality stuff. Uh, but the, to do quality guys it takes a lot of work it takes a lot of work and I'm trying my best but here's an example so this is the timeline okay this is the video right here so anyway you guys get the idea now uh, the reason my videos look so good is because I've learned a couple tricks guys 
uh, first of all, if you have this software or any other software, editing software, make sure you do uh, you add sharpness, guys. That's one thing I can definitely recommend. Make sure you have a sharpness, in, and a sharpness makes your videos look crisper, cleaner, and nicer. Definitely recommend you guys do that. Also, if you don't have an auto contrast effect, this automatically adjusts the contrast for me. But if you don't have this, make sure you increase the contrast. It makes the colors pop and stuff like that. I definitely recommend it. Uh, for your voices, for your chat audio, uh, I, I would suggest you use equalizer and just bring in the front and down. It makes you sound more professional, makes you sound clean, cleaner and everything. If you're using Adobe Premiere like I am, make sure you use denoiser and maximize the reduction and then maximize the offset and it will make you sound really, really good. So those are the couple, uh, couple tips I have. Uh, the other tip is for re rendering. If you're rendering, uh, make sure you render with uh, H.264, which is the encoding format, and then I just use the preset default for YouTube. It comes with Adobe Premiere. I go to YouTube here, and then I, I use the um, 1080p 2997. I tried using uh, something more. I tried making a custom one, and I tried to increase the rendering quality, but to be honest, I think this is more than I need. Uh, if you try to increase the rendering quality, you'll, your render time would increase exponentially, and then YouTube automatically brings down your quality anyway, so you're not going to it's not going to make a difference. So if you render in 60 frames, for example, uh, YouTube is going to automatically shrink it to 30 frames. So all, all that upload time, render time is just a waste of time. So I don't suggest you do that. But this is Premiere and I love it. So I definitely recommend you getting this if you can afford 20 bucks a month. Uh, the other, for my graphic design, I use Adobe After Effects. Here we go. And a lot of people have asked me, Hike, can you make me a great intro or a corner logo like you have? And guys, the answer is no. I'm sorry, but it's no. Uh, the thing is, it takes a lot of work. I was pretty familiar with the software because I used to uh, go work at a, a local cable station while I was in high school when I was 17, 18. And I learned a lot to edit. I learned how to use the software. Uh, I think I was there for till I was 22. But to be honest, this um, intro and the corner graphic took me three days. And I think I was working about 12 hours all of those three days. So it's not something easy you can do. Uh, for example, this each one of these is a layer, right? Yes and no. Most of them are layers, but for example, this one right here is a composition. So if I click on this composition, that layer that you I clicked on right there, which is a composition, has all this layer in, inside it too. So it's work on top of work on top of work. So all of this is work on top of work on top of work on top of work on top of work. And so you can imagine how much uh, time it takes to do this. And unfortunately, if I was making graphics for uh, um, everybody, uh, unfortunately, I wouldn't have time to make any of my videos because it does take a long time to do. So I'm sorry, but I can't make graphics for you. But there's good news. There's tutorials on YouTube. There's free assistance. If you get the bundle I suggested and pay 20 bucks a month, you can call for assistance 24 hours a day. And there's people who are trained with the software that can actually take control of your computer and help you guys out with problems. They, and for the simple stuff, there is YouTube um, uh, tutorials you can uh, look, check out, and use. So I definitely suggest you guys use the software, try it out. I'm telling you guys, you can make this stuff yourself. There's a lot of help for you guys online. So this is what I use for my graphics. And it's really, really, uh, really, really good quality software. So I definitely suggest you get this. But for Adobe After Effects, one hiccup is you need a good, powerful computer uh, that can render. So make sure you have something dependable if you're going to try to go this route. The other thing I use is Photoshop right here. And it's a pretty simple software. Everybody knows Photoshop. You know, you can do simple stuff. And um, I definitely recommend it for your... Uh, uh, thumbnails and stuff like that and make sure you save your thumbnails as jpegs yeah youtube loves J jpegs so definitely do jpegs it's a nice compression so you won't go over to the two megabyte uh, size uh, so i definitely suggest you do that uh, and if you don't have photoshop you can use a bunch of other softwares there's a bunch of free editing software thumbnails are important but they're not that big of a deal so that's about it guys this is what i use uh, i'm probably in front of uh, this computer and in front of this software for hours every day i'm literally uh, it's a lot of work. I do this for you guys every day. Uh, and, and it's not just for you guys. I'm doing it for myself. In, in the beginning, I started doing it because I needed uh, something to do, something to cheer me up, something to get me out of my funk. And now I do it because you guys are supporting me. And um, the love you guys give me, I wouldn't be able to stop to do it. And the, re the reason I've been doing this three episode series is to show you my thanks for my thousand subscribe first thousand subscribers. I promised I would do something like this. And you, all of you have been asking me on how uh, what I use and how I do stuff so I figured you guys might appreciate that anyway if you have any questions please um, leave them to me in my in the comments I'll respond to almost I almost all, all almost always respond to all my comments if I can 
it's getting a little harder and harder. And then if you can afford 20 bucks to 30 bucks a month, I just definitely suggest you do this. It's a great, great software uh, bundle. You can get any of the softwares. I like it a lot. And by the way, I'm paying for this. They're not sponsoring me or anything like that, but I really like it. And I think it's, it'll help you make really good quality videos. So I'm definitely recommended. If you're new here, please subscribe. Give me a like for these videos and I'll catch you guys later. Uh, the next video you guys are gonna see is gonna be a live commentary video and then I'll be back from my vacation on Sunday It's my anniversary with my girlfriend and on Sunday. Uh, I'll be on playing again. So I'll catch you then everybody. Bye